What is something that you want to see the queer community leave behind in 2022? Something that I really, really, really want for the LGBTQIA community is not putting labels about history and the fact that we are LGBT because we tend to do that too. I know some people tend to believe that I'm non-binary and asexual and aromantic because I'm disabled and traumatized. But that's not the reason. Yeah, uh, I'm disabled, I'm traumatized, but that's not the reason why I'm non-binary or aromantic or asexual. I was those things before, even though I didn't knew it. But when I was a kid, I realized already that I was aromantic and maybe asexual. But I wasn't traumatized yet. So <laughs> yeah, we have to unlearn what the cis straight community uh, have put in our brains like that LGBT plus is an illness or in result of an illness of over traumatized because it's so, so, so wrong. I have to do better, including myself. I have a lot to do better.